And this morning we're giving you live coverage of the berthing of Northrop Grumman's uh, Cygnus resupply craft to the International Space Station. The space station currently off the coast of Uruguay, flying 261 statute miles above the Earth. Over the next several minutes, we'll see Cygnus um, move closer to the International Space Station and the common berthing mechanism on the Unity module of the space station on the Earth-facing side. You can see Cygnus moving slowly now on the left and the space station on the right with that common berthing mechanism in the middle of the screen. And once again, we can see that Canada Arm 2 in motion, uh, moving the Cygnus resupply craft closer to the International Space Station. And this is a live view from the common berthing mechanism, uh, now aligning with the Cygnus resupply craft. As you can see here, uh, there are a series of bolts that will need to be secured in place uh, to make sure Cygnus is properly attached to the common berthing mechanism on the Unity module. Robotics controllers on the ground now using that Canada Arm 2 to once again continue bringing that Cygnus resupply craft closer to the International Space Station. A great view of that Cygnus resupply craft and the common berthing mechanism as we are in a hold right now uh, while the team does some final checks preparing Cygnus to berth with the International Space Station. The Canon Arm 2 in motion once again to continue to reposition that Cygnus resupply craft to uh, be berthed to the common berthing mechanism aboard the Unity module on the International Space Station. That Canada Arm 2 now in motion once again, bringing Cygnus closer to the International Space Station. All operations currently being controlled from uh, the ground by robotics controllers. We can see Cygnus slowly moving in toward the common berthing mechanism, preparing for first and second stage capture, first being uh, the series of latches that you see, and second being a series of 16 bolts. Ready to latch, looking uh, good. Cygnus is now currently in its berthing position and uh, ready for first and second stage capture to begin soon. And just received the green light for first stage capture. That first stage will be a series of uh, four latches. And those are now in progress, uh, securing Cygnus to the International Space Station. 
We've just received uh, confirmation of first stage capture. Robotics controllers will now control the arm to uh, go limp for the remainder of the birthing process. And arm is now confirmed limp. This sets up the second stage capture to begin shortly. You can see Cygnus slowly moving as it is uh, further attached to the space station. A great view of Cygnus just outside the Unity module of the International Space Station, 250 statute miles above the Earth, crossing over the Bay of Bengal. And those bolts are currently driving. Uh, once tightened and complete, the berthing of uh, Cygnus will be complete to the International Space Station. We've just received confirmation that all 16 bolts are now uh, tightened and secured with the Cygnus resupply craft. Birthing occurred at 6.31 a.m. Central Time while the space station was 250 statute miles above eastern China.